The Senate spokesperson, Ajibola Bashiru, says the 1.5-kilometer road behind the palace of Atawa Jao of Ushubu will be completed on or before end of February 2023. Senator Bashiru was speaking during the flag-off of the reconstruction of a road in Ushubu, where he used the occasion to ask Nigerians to vote for the presidential candidate of the APC, Ashiwa Jibola Tinubu, and all national candidates of the party for all-round development. TVC News correspondent Rafi Hamid has more in this report. It's 1.5 kilometer road behind the palace of Atajo of Ushubu. It spans through market stores to Ishwata, Ishoyama, Ishoyiwi, and Ishoyusu, all in Ushubu. The road was constructed about 34 years ago and had been in a sorry state for about 20 years. The Senate spokesperson, Ajivala Bashiru, assures that the road will be completed within one month. For the past, for the past three and a half years that have been in the Senate, our facilitated projects are in excess of 2.5 billion to also central central district, and all of them have been completed. As I speak, I mean today, more than 1,000 solar lights have been erected in all the 10 local governments. 40 schools have been completed, and the 60 amoeboro I mean, have been uh, erected. This is not the first road we are going to be constructing. We have also constructed a road from uh, Abaku, Alakpeni, up to Sabo in the Shogo local government. And we have also graded, I mean, close to uh, 200 kilometers of road in rural areas in the central central district. The road, when completed, will boost economic activities in the area. While the contractor was about to start work, some armed policemen were said to have invaded the site and sent away the contractor on the instructions of one Alaji Muniru Raji, who claimed to be in government in power. A Muniru Raji, who has always claimed to be a political and for the progress of Ushobo, is reported to have visited the site immediately after this flag off and to um, the market women that and told the market women that APC is no longer in power. Therefore, it's serving senator, in person of Senator Surajuddin Najibala Basiru, cannot rehabilitate the road. After his address, thugs and miscreants were mobilized and they dismantled the map lines. Construction of the road would have commenced immediately, but for the disruption, arrest, and alleged threats to life which has made the contractor to stay away from the site. It is expected that the police and leaders of Oshogo will wade into the matter before it degenerates into crisis. Rafi Hamid, TVC News, Oshogo.